This is a quick tutorial on how to create and publish a website using this free online tool called readymag.com. It's, it's really easy to use ReadyMag and um, really a, a very friendly tool for graphic designers to create mockups of websites and uh, it supports responsive design so you can actually see how your website looks in multiple devices and it, it's all of this for free so um, check it out um, so let's go into the um, readymag website so once you click uh, sign up and you log in you can cre start creating your websites so on the bottom uh, panel you will see a create button so click on create you will create your first project right. so you can uh, start with a blank page so the um, website gives you a blank page to start with and you can start working on it so you can change uh, this to home page and you click on the edit button and you, you will get the layout where you can start adding your elements and do your design so uh, this is basically your tool bar so you can see that you can switch from desktop to mobile layout here and see how it looks on uh, all the platforms there is an undo and redo button and also these are the widgets that you'll be using uh, sort of like layers in your file so what I'm going to do is I'll create a grid so um, I will create a uh, an eight grid layout just to help me out to set the uh, the website, and I will do uh, sort of a vertical. Uh, So this uh, grid is basically to help you align your objects uh, beautifully in your web layout. So I'm going to do that, and I'm turning the snap on. So basically, it, it's you know snaps onto the guides that you just created. So once you've done uh, your grids, you can start adding your elements. So I'm going to go to the Add Widgets button. This is where you can add your elements. Into the site. So I'm going to start with the text. So we have an interesting body text which just appeared. So I'm going to just select it and uh, move it so that it sort of I'll, I'll align it to this grid. Now I'll create another text and I'll make it the heading text heading goes here so what we can do is now we have the text selected you can click on the text button you can increase the text size you can change your typeface here so I'm going to just go to system and I will select a serif font right here so I've done that and I'll move the And you can see the elements that you have uh, added. So I'm going to select that. And uh, what I will do is I will just bring it to this. Okay, that looks pretty okay. So I have my heading and I have my body text. And now I need to add a button. So I'm going to click on button. So it comes uh, here. I'm going to align it here. And I can change the button text. Uh, enter. And I can also change the options here. So I'll just click on options. I can change the color to be uh, black. And I can also change the radius. Make it a little rounded on the edges. Okay. 
Cool. So now I have the button as well. Um, we can add a logo here. So what I'm going to do is I'll just go to shapes and uh, I'll just create a shape which is already there. So I'll just create a triangle and uh, I'll just use that as a logo. So let be here. Yes. So somewhat somewhere here. So that's where my logo goes. I can also add an image. So just click on picture and I can choose an image from here, drag and drop it, the image will appear here. So what I'm going to do is I'll just place the image in my here, I'll just scale it up a bit uh, and I will keep it somewhere here. So now I have um, the image as well. What I can do is I can just go here and I can uh, turn off the grid. And see how uh, my website looks right now. I can also select this and I can click give a uh, link. So if you have multiple pages in here, you can link this to a page or you can uh, link it to an external website. So once you've done that, you can click on this button and you can preview this website and you click on this it goes to the site everything is working another thing that you can do is you go to the edit panel and you change your desktop view to mobile so you can see how your website appears in the mobile phone and you can change um, you know your look and feel what you want to apply um, to appear in the website so bring this here mm -hmm. I can bring the text up in the bottom sort of here and if I preview I can see how uh, the website appears on uh, mobile phone and once you're happy with it you can click publish and the website will be published so this is how easy the whole process of um, web publication is with readymag.com and it's totally free you can also uh, go with the premium version which has some additional offers and lets you have some free space as well so hope this was useful and i'll see you uh, with another video till then bye